Hello guys, hello again. So, let's start with McDonnell Douglas DC3 Dakota C47 variant. Okay, let's start with wings. You can use snap knife to clear the parts. Okay. Caution, don't glue these two parts together. This is just slide in parts. Don't glue this. Okay. You can start with this central wings parts. Cut this support with knife. Cut out this support. Okay, now try it without glue. Okay. Now let's apply CA glue, medium CA glue, medium viscosity CA glue, apply to the outer flange. Okay, so now apply the CA glue also to the inner structure of the wing. Like this. Okay. Now push the parts together. Let's now set the CA glue with CA glue activator. Check this groove. This groove must be clear without CA glue. Now we can proceed with next part of the wing. Please don't glue. Don't glue these two parts together. This is the untouchable part of the wing. You can try it without glue. Okay. Okay. Now proceed with flaps and ailerons. You can clear the parts with knife. Some imperfections. Okay. Now it's very important with this, with this last part of the aileron, check the right left side. This is R, letter R or letter L. You can see the shape goes up. Okay, now we can start with reinforcing the wing with filament. We recommend use poly air.
push it to the groove. Okay, this one, this one we will do after we glue the engine gondolas. So, just this one, not this one. No. Apply some glue. You can use thin CA glue or medium. Okay, you can proceed. Proceed the exact same way with the next part of the wing. Okay, now we can install the flaps and ailerons. Again, use filament. And insert it. Now cut this 10 millimeters carbon tube. The exact exact is 69.5 centimeters. 69 and a half centimeters. Okay. And glue this end piece into the carbon tube like this okay, that's it. insert this plate to the slot in you can see the mechanism of the flaps